elected congressman, Fred Keller, held a rockin' party at the Sealands Grove BFW to celebrate his win in Tuesday's special election for the 12th congressional seat. Keller said the victory was humbling. I really feel humbled that the people have the confidence in me to do the job. The people of the 12th Congressional District are superb, they're outstanding individuals, and they deserve somebody to work as hard for them as they do every day. While speaking to the crowd, Keller thanked many of his supporters, including the family that got him his first job out of high school. And then it makes me reflect back. If you think over 30 years ago, Fred first came to our offices and uh, filled out an application for a job opening we had listed. And then two days later, Fred came back and wanted to check and say, I just want you to know I'm still interested in that job. Two days later, Fred came back and called and said, told the HR director, I just want you to know I'm still interested in that job and I hope I get it. And finally the HR director came to us and said, you know, this Fred Keller guy is so determined and persistent. I think we just need to hire him. And we did. Uh, the Bingham family means so much to me. Uh, over the years, uh, you know, I went to work in, in the factory uh, right out of high school, and uh, I couldn't thank them more for the values they taught me as a young man how to behave and how to work hard and do what's right. So I thank the Bingham family so much. Uh, you took this. Keller said he'll do what's best for the people in the 12th district. There's one person who I, who I follow blindly, and that's my wife, okay? Uh, again, I make decisions based upon what's best for the people of the 12th Congressional District. And, and clearly, the people of the 12th Congressional District, the majority of them, agree with the policies that the president has. And, and putting America's families and workers first, I don't see a problem with that. I'm going to tell you the kind of guy our president is. The last thing he said to me on that phone call was, please tell your family hello for me. What a guy. Yeah. Yeah.